Back in 2002, we began exploration education asking ourselves, what is it that would make teaching science in the home a successful and rewarding experience? Homeschooling our own four children, we knew the importance of having a curriculum that was solid in its teaching, and yet at the same time, easy for parents to implement. So we thought, what if the curriculum included everything you need, was self-directed, and provided an engaging and solid science foundation for the student? But well, we now offer K through three, fourth through sixth, and seventh to 10th grade year-long physical science courses that have this unique combination of ease of use, solid teaching, and a hands-on approach. The content is so important. When developing the textbooks, we wanted them to be thorough, highly engaging, and easily understood by the student. This is why we chose to use the interactivity of the computer for the text. The old saying, a picture paints a thousand words, is really true. We rely heavily not just on the text and still images, but on animations and interactive questions to help the student understand and process the scientific concepts they are learning. Teaching for 15 years showed me the importance of a student applying what they have learned. Just like we don't simply stop at teaching a mathematical principle, but then we have the students apply and practice it, we wanted the students to do the same with their science. We chose to use a project-based approach so that the student could apply and experiment with projects that were more like real life. So, for example, when they are learning about sound, tone, pitch, resonance, echoes, and absorption, they experiment with a working guitar that they have built. When studying thermodynamics, the advanced students build a working steamboat that they use in their experiments. They are very proud of what they have built, and they look forward to using their projects throughout the course. The step-by-step -step pictorial and video instructions ensure the student's success in both building their projects and using them in their experiments. Reinforcement is an important part of any curriculum. Aside from the obvious reinforcement the experiments provide, the logbook allows for a high level of reinforcement as well. Students use it to answer questions, fill out their hypothesis, experiment data, and theory. It becomes a tremendous portfolio at the end of the year. There are also vocabulary word quizzes and for the advanced course, we provide quarter exams. Over the years, the consistent feedback we have received on our courses is that the projects and experiments work, the students can complete them on their own, they retain what they learn, and they love their science. For after all, when you love something, you learn. It.